good morning everyone and welcome this is our first video and we are melissa and bud Hi there. <laughs> hey we're full-time resellers from southern maine we yard sale and shop the goodwill bins to find stuff to flip for profit on ebay and our store is high luna named after our fur beast <laughs> so feel free to check it out we plan to un upload one video a week at the moment to share our experiences and our picks. So thanks for being part of our first video. Uh, so today I'm going to share what we got in our first, uh, not our first because we've been doing this for a while. <laughs> this is our first video for it. <laughs> but I'm going to share what we got from, in this bag from our haul yesterday at one yard sale. The first thing that we're gonna share is this bag we picked this up for three bucks and it was just a miscellaneous um beanie baby bag but we do pretty good flipping these these are those little ty uh babies they had like those big round um eyes that have the circle around them some of these are going to have to be cleaned up and we steam them and process them for pictures. But this is the other one. So sometimes we list these as lots if they're like everything the same all together. Like these two look like a mama and a baby. They'll go together. And they're super cute. They have a little tail. Buddy butts. And we got a monkey, which is perfect because we have a monkey. <laughs> we have a toddler that goes around with us. So we got like three jobs going at once. All right, so that's bag number one. There. And the next thing I grabbed was, um, it was like a lot of three of them. Look at how cool they are. We've got Cabbage Patch, and then we've got, I don't know why these aren't going to come apart, they're tape. So we got these three for a buck, and the first one is Cabbage Patch. So they're the Magic Color Fun Set. You have 16 pictures to color, and they come with their own pens and things like that to do in there. And this one's my favorite. It's strawberry shortcake. These are cool. These are like the um what are they Crayola calls it? The um colorless color system. But those are really cool. Then the find of the day was the Dooney and Burks bag. Look at how cute this is. It's one of the originals. It's got the little duck on the back. And it's in a really great condition. Um, I did end up looking this up after we left and it was nice because the owner had put um, airbags in there and looked like she didn't even really use it that heavily. I, it has a little bit of cleaning and wear and tear on the leather on the inside. Like there's a, a mark here. It looks like from a pen, um, on the inside, it looks like just normal wear and tear on a bag. And it's cool because it's one of the originals. And I think this is a color that is really in right now. Is that like a camel khaki? Whatever you want to call it. But that I looked up and it was going for 80. So we might lower it a little bit just... Um, because of the wear and tear on it and we want people to have a great deal. Let me put this paper back in. Alright, sorry, that's probably annoying on the camera. Okay, next thing. We got a lot of little baggies there. These are so fun. These are one of our favorite things to list is the little action figures in our store or little people or what, whatever you can get your hands on this little. I love it. <laughs> this one has, look at how cute he is. Oh God, he's so stinking cute. 
Uh, let's see. He's from, I don't know what he's from. I'm going to have to do some research. I think these are just older Fisher Price mixed in with not Fisher Price. Like, I don't think that last one is, but this one is a little older one. Uh, it's a sheepy from the farm set. And I got also really cute farm sets and a school set from Fisher Price. She had a good mix of uh, vintage toys and newer toys. The next one is a Smurf lot. We got a lot. And then, oh, this set was a dollar. Just so you know. I think the bag was three dollars. I didn't say that. But this bag was 25 cents. And we got... I don't remember any of the Smurf names. Smurf guy one. Football Smurf guy. Baseball Smurf guy, which I think is really cute. We might keep that one. And then we got two pandas, because that's what you do. Random pandas in there. So we'll look those guys up and see what they are. Look at all those. It was so cute. This one's like as big as my... As big as my finger there. He's so tiny. I don't think we've done any Smurfs yet either for flipping. So that will be interesting to find out... Uh, more information on that. We do pretty good with like Pokemon and a lot of Batman, the Marvels. We do good with um, a lot of stuffies and plush. So we'll just add it to our repertoire. The next thing is this Pokemon collector series. It's Valentine's Day. That's so cool. I don't know what that we bought that for. Probably a buck. Okay, so let's do the sets next. This is the first one. We've got the little schoolhouse. That was $5. They both were $5 for these houses, but I haven't opened them to see what's in there. Oh my gosh! We got lots of little people. The case itself looks really clean. It has not really much wear and tear. A little bit on the sides over here for scuffing. And usually I feel like all the stickers are starting to peel. So that's, it was nice to find it in such good condition. And then these are all like the little kiddos. She's cute. We got a boy. So there's a few in there. So paid five bucks for that set. Sorry, it's so crinkly. Alright, the next one was the little farm set. Ooh, look at so cute. I haven't decided if I'm going to sell these together or separate, but they're going for about $15 to $20 on eBay. This one has all the little animals in it, so we've got a rabbit and a rooster and we have a doggy. A little pig. Farmers. There's a lot of exciting ones to go through there. A couple bunnies in there. And a couple different kinds of chickens and stuff. So that's wild. We'll check that out. Uh, see how that does. Those are our first real play sets that we um, got for the Fisher Price. We get tend to get in the bins all little Fisher Price dolls and the animals, and we'll flip those as sets. 
Um, this one was eight dollars, and it's Weevil Wobbles, but I think they're the newer ones. Here's the astronaut for that Weevil Wobble, and we have a doctor. And oh, I like that one a lot, a fireman. That's cool. There's a policeman. We have a soccer player, and I think these go for anywhere, depending on what ones you have. Like, there's the, the an artist one, and then there's a skater girl. She tends to go for, like, I think $10. The lesser ones are going to, like, the doctor and stuff. I, I don't know what they go for, but I think they're, like, five. These ones just, I think they had higher demand in them. So we got two, four, six, eight, ten, eleven of those for eight dollars. So you figure, you know, you get anywhere from five dollars a piece for them. That's a pretty good flip. All right, we're almost to the end of our bag here, but we got this. We got a home light switch, Wi-Fi, smart, flexible controls. This is in this package. It looks like it hasn't been used. Opened but not used. Alright, we're going to dig out all the... This is what we got left. We got a pile of smalls. These were mostly 25 cents. A uh, dollar for these, but they think these are older... Um, I want to say they're Fisher Price, but I'm looking on the leg for them and I don't see it. Um, I guess I'll have to look that up and see what those are. The next one is like little G.I. Joes and we have Pokemon. And this is a random cool dude. Looks like he's ready for MTV Spacewalk with Godzilla. Then we got, I don't know who this one is. I feel like I know a lot of these little characters, but not that one. Don't know what that one is. So he looks pretty cool. Oh yeah. And we got Mini Yoda. Hmm. You will find good yard sales, you will. Okay, so that's that one. This one looks like it's more... The Pokemon. Don't know what this guy is called. Yogi Bear? Hey, Boo Boo! Little random dude. We got a Yoshi. We got whoever this guy is. Wow, he looks pretty fierce. <laughs> and we got Bart, people. We got the dope man. <laughs> Bugs Bunny. Pokemon, I think. Okay, so let me throw those back in. All right, we've got these two little people, older style. They were a buck, or a fifty cents actually. We'll see what they go for. And this one has tiny little Yodas. Look at them. Oh, he's so cute. He's got his like green lightsaber going. He is one with the force. <laughs> and then we got a pew pew guy. 
and Darth Vader. Oh my. It has these weird things in there that look like uh, you built something, built a car maybe. I don't see any more Star Wars ones. Oh, I got one more. I don't know who that guy is. We have a Sonic. It's a flocked Sonic. That's wild. That guy is tiny too. Whoop. Bag down. So this is the rest of what's in here. We've got like just miscellaneous little figures. Sometimes with this we might sell it as a lot. Other times if it's not very much or we don't can't figure out what it is, we'll just end up chucking it. But for those little figures in there, that might be fun. And they got like Green Lantern here. I don't think that's really Green Lantern. We got a mermaid. We went to go see that little mermaid movie. Oh my god, that was amazing. Our, we have a the little toddler, and she was loving it. Ate her popcorn in her seat, and was enjoying the movie. They have like little connector things in here. Capricorn. A rake. <laughs> Alright, so that's pretty much it. I think that's everything. The other thing that we got was a meat thermometer. That's for ourselves. <laughs> so, it works. That was two bucks. And that was a pretty good haul. We spent $30 all together at the sale. Which is a bit more, but we got like the Dooney and Burks, the two Fisher Price farms, with lots of figures to sell. Um, so we will probably put inserts in here of what we listed it for um, on our site, and we'll go from there. And if you liked this, give us uh, some good feedback and some thumbs up. We'd appreciate it. Thanks for joining our first video. Bye, guys.